Welcome back to a later day and a returning gameplay. I'm Scarlet Ribbons, and this is The Frozen Garden, a third-person psychological horror. Okay, I'm using the mouse to look. It's interesting. Oh man, okay, so this is very, um, very tank controls, it looks like. Can I look? No. Oh yeah, look at this. <laughs> so this game is meant to be very similar to tank control games from like back in the day, like. This is going to be something to get used to here. Oh, wait a minute. What's that? Oh, this is going to be... This is going to take me a second to get used to this. Okay, so I can't click. Hello? <laughs> oh, man. In the chain controls, they reverse. Um up a watering can. Anything else? No? No? Hmm. So how are you guys doing? Woo! Yeah, so the, the controls like reverse when the camera changes, so you have to, this is gonna be, um, it's a horror game, just so you guys know. Uh, I believe it's probably going to be mostly, like, stealth mechanics. First, I should water the plants. They're dying. Oh, well. I guess I could do that, but I, I imagine I need water. So, there must be a... Oh, wait. I was going to say there might be a well, but we have... It's like a, like a fountain type of thing here. The fountain. It's too cold. Oh, well, that sucks for me. Got heating controls here? No? No. Okay. So, I think we're looking for a well, as I assumed. Oh, we run like a dork. Okay, let me stop messing with the mouse. So, like I was saying, this game is a horror game. I kind of picked it up with the intent that it looked vaguely Silent Hill-ish. And there are supposed to be, like, enemies in this game, so we're gonna have to figure out these controls. Um, so far, we don't seem to have a stamina bar, which is excellent. Can I cut across? I can. Uh, what happens if I do this? Okay, we can run on frozen water. We run, we run like we've never been in gym class before. Although for somebody who's never been in gym class, we sure do uh, have great stamina. No? Okay. Let's try this door over here. First, I should water the plant. Well, huh. Okay, is there like a spigot, maybe? Let's go back this way. Maybe I missed something. Let's see. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Nope, we can't go that way, okay? Making the ice, how to do. Can I, oh, okay, right-clicking seems to focus this 
Okay, focuses. Oh, I see. Okay, so when you right click, it focuses where uh, you have the the mouse pointed in that direction. So we can look up. So if that's the case, maybe we did miss something. I'm gonna go back to the shed under the assumption I missed something. Let me check this thing too. Turn around, stupid. Right there. No, nothing. As far as I can tell, we cannot get over there. So I don't think we can. Space. I'm not seeing a way to get up there. Do I have an inventory? Tab? I? Oh, here we go. It's a watering can. It's already filled. I can use it in the garden. The plants are... Okay. Oh. What did I do there? How did you get up there? Oh. Tab did that. Okay. Tab brings up your FPS, apparently. Well, we're figuring out the controls, which is a good thing. So we don't, I don't mind that. I'm probably going to cut a lot of that for you guys just to save on time. So what I just found out was I have an inventory, which we can access with I, and then you close it with I. And the watering can is actually already full. So we actually probably could have just clicked on plants. I was under the assumption that it was not full. Start here, I guess. Aha! Okay. That's different. I thought it was straight up winter. Okay, so um, in the Steam page, the game, it does mention that you're basically trying to keep a garden alive. And for whatever reason, there are enemies involved in this. There's some kind of mystery going on. But we don't know what. Um, oh. Oh, okay. Oh, hi! What are you doing down there? Is this gonna be like a James Sunderland situation? He killed his own wife? She's fine. She's good. I mean, she wouldn't be in there if she didn't want to be. Okay, we got footy prints. Footy prints. Uh, I guess I can go inside now. Yes, I can. All right. Welcome to my abode. It is certainly something. All right, we got a flashlight. As I continue to make a fool of myself with these controls. <laughs> No? Okay. So, as far as I can tell, we can't interact with these things. Whee! Let's go back this way. Okay, one of the more fascinating aspects of Japanese supernatural belief is the concept of Yurei no Jikan, or the hour of ghosts. According to tradition, this is the hour between 2 and 3 in the night when the veil between... The living and the dead is the thinnest. At this time, ghosts are believed to be able to pass through and interact with the living world. If you guys hear any odd noises during my recording, it is my dog. Everyone else in the house is asleep because we're night people. Um, and it's early morning when I'm recording. It's the only time I can record. And the dog is currently wandering. She was trying to knock over a speaker here in the room. Because she's a fool. Okay, so, none of that. At some point, I'll have this figured out. Maybe. I mean, if I play it long enough, surely I will. Okay, this is blocked. I'll face and go this way. 
Um, we're gonna go for the door closest to the front door. This one right here. Turn around. There we go. Okay, we got... Oh yeah, pictures. Look at that. Yeah, my wife picked these. She, uh, that's why she's in the pond, because she's not very good at decor. But I guess it's fair, because I'm not good at walking. We have our strengths. Okay, we have like a open case of some kind. It's a painting. Picks spring. Fascinating. Oh my gosh. Painting. Picking summer. <gasps> Depicting winter. And what's this? A forest fire? Autumn. Okay, that works too. Okay. So it's just a tiny room with essentially nothing in it. This is blocked. Okay, so we'll go upstairs. Excuse me, coming upstairs. I float. Can turn the lights on? Nope. Well, open door. An open door is an invitation. And hello. Can't do anything there. Our bed. Our bed. This is where we do all the nasty, naughty stuff. That's why all the cobwebs are here. We're, um, we're strange people. We don't work like you guys work. You know? Our biological functions are biologically different. What? It's a crack in the wall. I can't see anything. Well, you can give her a press F to use that. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Nope, oh, I had it right. No, I don't. Help! I'm stuck! A little bit more. There you go. Or not. Back it up. I'm gonna get out of here yet. I promise you. It'll happen. Okay, can I close the door or something? Jesus. Oh my god. Okay, for some <laughs> Look, okay, don't look at me that, that way, okay? I, I... I have no excuse for myself. I thought this right side jam of the door... I don't know. I don't know with myself anymore. We now know what we're getting into, which is gonna be an absolute mess. Okay, so if we know it's between two and three... Can we change the clock? E. F. Okay. And I went outside. Ah, yes, the footy steps are going this way. I could have tried to follow them a little bit better, but exploring the house was probably a good thing, seeing as we got the flashlight out of that. Doesn't look like anything has changed there, so we'll keep moving. I'm gonna try to leave the mouse alone. I have no reason to really mess with it. Okay, footsteps went to the door. Yeah, so we don't really have much uh, cause to mess with uh, with the mouse too much. It just really is just to help us look around for the most part, but otherwise turning his head does nothing for us. I'm gonna try to stay off the road just because I don't believe. Are we still following the footsteps though? Because if we're still following the footsteps. Uh, yeah, we are. Okay, so we do need to go this way. You just run down the middle of the road that's not, like, you know, potentially dangerous at all. I'm gonna have you guys keep your eyes out in the background. Oh! That's that shit I was talking about right there. See what happens when you do shit like that? Uh, anyway, what I was saying was, uh, as I stand here in the road, um, 
I'm going to have you guys keep your eyes out on the background as the camera angles change, because I don't know if there's going to be anything hidden in those backgrounds. Uh, I don't see the car. Okay. I don't know if we're going to have any hidden ghosts or anything like that, or what have you. Wow, these, these angles are something. But yeah, I don't know if there is anything actually going to be hidden there or not, so I'm going to leave that up to you guys to scavenger hunt if- oh, if so, hello! Uh, weren't you in the damn pond? No, I'm not a doctor, I can't help you. Um, what's happening? Whoa. Silent Hill? Is this meant to be like the siren? Uh-oh, have we gone to the other world? We might have. Ah, I can't see. Which way did I come from? Over here. No, wait. UFOs? Is that the route it's going for? It's gonna do the Silent Hill UFO thing? It's not actually monsters, but aliens. Which one could debate is a monster anyway? Oh shit! Boy, I know you better run faster than that! Better run like you got a purpose! I knew I was hearing something. Don't mind me, just gonna go on my usual jog. This is fine. Oh, okay, you're picking up speed. Hi. Well, I've only got one place to go, and that's to my house. You're not welcome. Oh, okay. Whip it back around here. Okay, he's hanging out in the trees, you freak! He's trying to stop me from getting to my homes. Can't stop me from getting to my homes, fool! Okay. Oh, get my flashlight out. Hold on. Oh. Damn these angles. Uh, 9.30? What am I... What am I doing here? Oh. Three. I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'm confused too. Okay, well I guess we'll check to see if these doors are still blocked. We know there's a hole upstairs. It seems like the more logical option. Nothing appears to have changed. And maybe nothing has changed because we're supposed to do something else. Maybe the time needs to be different. And this is still blocked. So there might be certain things, certain clues, or other things that we can only access at certain times. Let's see. 
It's not possible. You are here, my love. Are you still alive? I don't know. You tell us, bro. Okay, whatever that thing is, it's still out here. Oh yeah, there you are. So what are you? Alright, let's make a go for here. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh, okay. I mean, sure. So, let's assume... What? Where are we? Nine o'clock does nothing for us. Let's do... What about two? Right? It said 2 a.m. Oh. Mm-hmm. There we go. Oh, cool. You gonna give it to me or what? Okay. Picked up photos. Three. Okay. All right, so we did something. So let's check our inventory. This picture was taken outside a beautiful little place along the road outside our garden's gate. Under the picture it says 8.30. Ah, oh, okay. This picture, okay. Along the road outside the garden's gate. See, this picture was taken in the garden. Under the picture it says 5 a.m. This picture was taken near the lake at 8.30 a.m. Okay, so... I guess we're closer to 5 a.m. We'll do 5 a.m., 8.30 a.m., and then 8.30 p.m. I think is what we'll do. So, 5 a.m. It's our, it's our next time. Gone the wrong way again. Yeah, as frustrated as I am with these uh, tank controls, it's not too bad. Like, it's not super annoying. I'm not, like, thrilled with it or anything, but it's not a terrible mechanic, all things considered. Okay, so we're going to 5 a.m. Yeah. Okay, there appears to be a plaque here now. We got picked up a ring. Okay, we're gonna go back to the house because we're less likely to run into anything for the time being. I don't think that's always going to be the case, but it's one of our engagement rings, likely hers, given the nature of the, the stone and everything. Okay, so now we go to 8.30 a.m. Um, uh, the lake. Oh shit. Oh shit. Let me out. The lake! No! Get away from me, you fool! Let me try to lose him first. Okay. Oh. Get off that thing. 
Ah, pick it up. Picked up a seed. Okay, back to the house. Okay, so he's it's guarding things. I can't really say it's a he. It very likely could be our wife. Because obviously something happened there. So then we gotta go to 8.30 p.m. Uh, I. A seed. Okay. Okay. Alright, now this one should be outside the gates, right? Uh, along the road, outside our garden's gate. Okay. I keep wanting to hit the back button. don't know if there's a save system, so this might be a situation where we have to get this done in one shot. I'm not really sure. What up, fool? Get stuck on some trees, bitch! Get stuck on some trees, bitch! What, you mad? What, you mad? Like you mad or something? I'm gonna follow this, because we didn't do it the last time. So... It might be where that car crashed, to be honest. But I can't really say. For sure. We just know that it's along here somewhere. No, it said near the gate, didn't it? It said near the gate, so we gotta go back around. Get off me, bitch! Hmm. It's got like a haze around its face, like it's trying to suck your soul out or something, so I'm thinking... I'm thinking maybe it slows you down the closer it is. Said near the gate though. So where where near the gate? Along the road near the gate. Where is it? Okay, we seem to be able to go a little further this way. There's a path. I see a path. But I'm gonna stick to the gate. Uh okay, that's that's a cutoff. So we're gonna go this way. Aha! Okay! Cheating ass bitch! Hey, you cheating, bro! Come on, bro, you cheat. Cheap! Ah, no! Come on, 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 give it to me, give it to me! Red thread! She is mine, bitch! Serpentine! Serpentine! Serpentine on your ass! Can't touch this! Can't touch this! Right. No. We're almost there. Ooh, get off me! Shit. Just right away with your stupid self. Okay, we got a seed, a ring, and a red thread. Do we tie the red thread to the ring and do what with the seed besides? plant it, which seems like the more obvious thing, but where? Where do we plant it? Okay. We are inside. We are the safe for the moment. Uh, let's see. It's a red ball of yarn. A seed. It's one of our engagement rings. Uh, let's start with this hole that's upstairs. 
It's the most significant thing that we have right now. Who was that? Too dark to recognize. Okay, so let's try... The ring. No. Okay. Oh! Did we... Aha! Okay, so we've done this. Now what? Has anything changed? So I will say, this game's not giving us very- it's not giving us- okay. Any clues. Um, I don't know if this has to do with the time or if this is just a... Situation of- oh, there's an eyeball there. Well then. Hello? It wants me to give it something. Okay, so we have to give that something. Oh. Chains? Okay. Imagine there might be a new enemy here. Oh! Yeah, that'd do it. No! Oh, okay, just gonna sit there and take it, huh? Oh. Okay, well. You did, in fact, just sit there and take it. Um, the shame on you, sir. Can't see. And there it is. Shit. Stuck on shit. Stay away! Oh my god, it's like hair everywhere, bro. I don't know where I'm going. What up, dude? No? Okay. Picked up a left eye. Okay. For reasons unknown. Okay, so we're just... I guess we're wandering around looking for specific eyes. Okay then. Hello? Picked up a right eye. Okay. It's a little hard to see in here. Assuming we're going back. I mean, most things only have two eyes for the most part. I might have gone the wrong way. I feel like I went the wrong way. There's a light over here, though. What is this? I think we've been here, haven't we? Yeah. Alright. That's okay. We'll just whip it back around. I don't want to double back and run into that thing. Hopefully. 
Oh my god, okay. We made an error! Back off, bitch! Oh my god, I can't see, bro! Why you gotta be huffing and puffing like that, too? Is that necessary? How do I get out of here? Oh, come on. Oh, shit. Not good. Ah, damn it. So far, I followed the outside walls and like the inner side. So I don't know what the hell to do. Right. Get off me, bitch. I feel like half the way I did this was following like the red and white lights, but every time I've done it so far to try and get back, it's not working. So I don't know what to do. And like there's only so many paths. Yeah, see, we'll go by this shit, and this'll be, once again, a dead end. Yeah, that's that dead end up there. Fuck's sake. How the hell do you get out of here? Great. And he's on us. And he's on us. Damn it. Yeah, it doesn't help because my fingers are hurting, too. <laughs> Don't get stuck in there again. Okay, found our way back. Uh, yes? Now what? Hello? Okay. Hmm. So what else am I supposed to do? Okay. Girl. Oh, because we unchained. I gotcha. What's up? Ah, huggies. Gonna drag your ass in there. We got, uh, shininged. Alright, well, I guess that was the Frozen Garden. It was, uh, relatively short game. 
but uh, still very interesting. I would have liked to have seen more with it, more with the story. Why was she in there? I mean, we saw a car crash, so we can assume that's how she died, but... Did he actually stick her in that fountain, or is he just completely gone mad? Um, so I guess that's up for interpretation. I don't know how you would interpret the monsters, but uh, I don't know. Very interesting. Again, I would have liked to have seen more, but overall, it was still a really good game. So thanks for watching today, and I will see you on a later day.